Yo, what's up guys? I'm Daniel McCann and today I'm going to do a review of the app Clapper, TikTok's biggest rival. I'm going to tell you my likes and dislikes and whether you should join the app or not. So like most people during these corona times, I got addicted to TikTok. But all the while I've been looking out for other apps that can rival TikTok. I mean, Instagram has tried it, but it's a mess at the moment because it's got Reels, Instagram TV, it's Instagram, you can post pictures. It's just, I don't know even where to start with Instagram. I just think it's an absolute mess at the moment. As well as Instagram, um, we've obviously got YouTube, what we're on now. Still not really sure where YouTube Shorts is going. I'm not really sure what Facebook's doing at the moment. I think there's a few other apps that have tried it, but at the moment for me, the biggest app is Clapper. It kind of looks exactly like TikTok. I mean, if you put Coke and Pepsi together, they taste pretty much the same, but have a slight difference. That's my best way of putting it. So let's talk about the main differences. On Clapper, it is 18 plus, which is great if you're making content for more mature audiences. As well as that, your videos can be up to three minutes in length. Now with videos being longer, they put in a feature where you can fast forward and rewind on the For You page. Yes, it has a For You page. It is very much like TikTok, as I've said. But with that being said, Clapper wants their content to be completely original. That means if you post anything from TikTok onto Clapper, if it has any type of watermark, it will get taken down straight away. Trust me, it happened to me. I'm finding that they want it to be less about miming videos and cheesy trends and more about art. But with it being more about original content, there is less music on there. I think the music may grow on there, but they want it to be more original music. Like I've already said, it does have similar features to TikTok, so you can do video replies, but it also has an option to make group chats. Now, in terms of making money on Clapper, if you get so many followers, you can join something called the Clapper Fam. And once you're in there, you can make a regular income from posting on the app, which sounds great, but we'll sort of see how that goes because it's still very new and maybe they're doing this just to draw people in and get people away from TikTok itself. There is a lot of competition and that's what I find really exciting about it as a creator. Now, one great thing I'm finding out about it is that some of the content that I've put on TikTok gets taken down and a lot of the content I'm putting on Clapper is actually staying up. As well as that, you can live stream on there and a lot of people are getting banned on TikTok from live streams because of the algorithm and mass reporting. But like I say, Clapper is still very new so who's to say that their algorithm might not be as messed up as TikTok's and it might just be machines running it and in the future once there's more trolls on there Clapper will end up just like TikTok. Let's hope not. Let's hope it's an app where you can express yourself freely and there's not as many trolls and they have ways to sort out these problems and maybe more human beings working for them. I am going to do more research on the app and I'm going to make a follow-up video to this. But for now, I'm going to leave you with this because these are my first impressions. And yeah, I'm just excited because if anything, it's just more places to put your content, more places to get seen. So if you're a creator, I would get on this app. I really would. Remember, you have to be over 18. Thanks for watching again, guys. If you want to check out any of my content or if you want to follow me on Clapper or TikTok, I'll put the links below the video. And I hope everyone has a great day today. Much love, guys. Absolutely buzzing. What's happening, guys? I'm Daniel McCann, and today I'm going to do a review of the Clap app. -er. Yo, what's happening, guys? I'm Daniel McCann, and today I'm going to do a review of the Clap. <laughs>